This one's for all the savvy shoppers out there. I'm gonna share a great place to get sewing supplies online. Welcome to The Sewing Report, I'm Jen. I upload weekly videos about sewing crafts and DIY projects. I just got a delivery in from a new resource for sewing supplies, notions, ironing stuff, and I wanted to share it with you. It is called cleanersupply.com. That is with one S, so it's cleanersupply.com. And I found it earlier this week because I was looking for more iron cleaner. Now, hint, if you are a frugal sewist like I am, you're always looking to save money, and this website, oh my gosh, the prices were incredible. I used to use the faultless like hot iron cleaner, but then I discovered this stuff called Easy Off. It pretty much does the same thing. It's about the same price. The difference, the tube is like five times bigger. So I'm getting five times the value by using this product versus the faultless stuff. So I have switched over and I was looking for more of this because I clean my iron all the time. It always gets skunk on it. And I stumbled upon to cleanersupply.com and I was looking around and they had tons of stuff. So I decided to place an order and I'm going to show you what I got. This site reminds me a bit of Wawak Sewing, W-A-W-A-K.com. That's another site I go to pretty often. They have great prices on sewing related stuff, pressing things, stuff for tailoring. They've got a massive amount of inventory and that's what I've noticed with cleanersupply.com also. Great prices, lots of very random stuff, but a lot of things that will be useful to sewists. So I picked up two more tubes of the Easy Off. Two fifty nine dollars guys. I, I was like so happy about that. This stuff is so cheap and it works so well. I normally keep a white serger thread in my serger, so I picked up four more cones. These were about $1.99. I think I have the same brand in the serger now, but now I know I will not run out of white. Tons of zippers. I got a variety of different sizes and styles. Most of them have this white zipper tape and then they have the brass hardware. I don't really have a lot of zippers that have the uh, like purse size zipper tabs on it. So I was very excited to get something that is easier for me to open and close. And then I finally picked up double headed zipper that I can use in larger like bags or like train cases. I kind of want to make something cool like that. So I got a couple sizes. Again, these were like under $2 for each zipper. So I felt like they were a pretty good deal. And then I got some thread. I was really excited to find both gold and silver Guterman metallic thread. This is super cool. And I wanna to try to use this in the embroider machine. We'll see how it goes. Because while I like the metallic thread I have that's like all metallic, sometimes it can be a little bit tricky in the embroider machine. So I'm kind of wondering how this stuff will do, but this was pretty reasonably priced. I'm going to place my order screen up now so you can see everything I ordered and what I paid. I did try to pad my order to get up to the $99 free shipping. The biggest purchase was six spools of 50 weight Mako Arafil thread. The price on this, it was like $7.50 for each spool. I was looking on some other websites and they're charging like $11, $12 for the exact same thing. I was kind of running low on white, so now I have two more white spools of thread, and then I decided to get some fun colors. Now, one thing I did notice about cleanersupply.com is that the color renderings of the spools of thread, I didn't find to be quite accurate to what I got. This uh, more fuchsia color thread, it was called fuchsia on the website, but it came across as more of a hot pink. So that's what I thought I was getting, but it's a lot darker than I was expecting. This darker, more lime green thread, read more as a Kelly green. And then when I got it, I discovered that I already own this same color thread, but just in 40 weight. And same with the purple. I thought I was getting a lighter purple. It wasn't quite what I was expecting. So if you are going to order Arafil thread on this site, they have great prices, but also cross check the color and the number maybe elsewhere on the internet just to see what the color actually is because the pictures on the website were pretty inaccurate. I also had one comment from another Sewing Report viewer saying that they had ordered from this website some needles and they got some needles that weren't quite what they ordered, like they would order Microtex, and then the actual needle they got said universal. So you might wanna be careful with ordering needles. Again, that was not my experience, but the thread color was a, was a little bit off in my own opinion, but those are pretty minor. The prices on this site are so great that I, I'm still a very happy customer and I was able to overlook it because still cool colors, just not 
quite the colors that I was expecting. The shipping was actually quite fast. It only took three to four days from the time I ordered to the time I received the package. And I believe they're in like upstate New York. So it had quite a ways to go. Overall, really like this site. I think there's a lot of things that sewists can use on it. And I just wanted to share this as another resource for you if you are ordering sewing supplies. I also really like Wawax Sewing. And if you have any sort of secret websites you go to for sewing supplies that you feel not a lot of people know about, feel free to share that below in the comments. I would be curious as well because I'm always looking for new places to get great deals. Overall, really glad I discovered cleanersupply.com. I will certainly be ordering from them again. They had such a great variety of things and I will, I will be back guys, I'll be back. Anyways, I'm Jen with The Sewing Report. I have lots of other reviews here on the channel of various products and other websites that I've ordered from, so check one of those out. I'll see you guys again in the next video.